All right, got about five studs, um, no, approximately eight foot studs. One I'm already cut in half to 37 and a half feet. So that'll give me some distance. This is gonna be my flywheel right here. The base is right there. It's gonna be sitting on this, will not be on the ground, but I will have this hub bearing. All right, came from a car. All right, of course I will have to drill a little hole right here. So our bearing right there can evenly spin, well, spin around. I'm gonna have a little two inch section, two by two inch section cut off out of here, and they're gonna be mounted right here on the um, our two by fours. All right, but that hub fits to this rim. I will have to put spacers on it so the tire will not rub itself. It does look pretty tall because that is a very tall, gonna be a very tall uh, uh, flywheel. Um, my shaft will be an axle. Let's see, that one moves, so I'm gonna, that's fine, but this, they both kind of move. That's fine because you know it's gonna have a bearing supporting it. Um, anyway, when I'm done, Here's my plans right here. Found this online, it was pretty neat. The only difference is I thought it was pretty green because right now all I spent was $18 on wood and $18 on a bunch of hag screws. Um, and I only got all half the screws is what I need. I'm only missing a few things. But anyway, I'll update later and I'll show you what I have.